A Bangor High School student has some innovative ideas and the brain power to execute them. In fact, he is among the top 2% of STEM students in the entire country. Vetri Vell recently participated in a major nationwide competition entering a creation that could aid Maine's elderly. New Center Maine's Hannah Yashivi introduces us. At 16 years old, Vetri Vell could teach most people a thing or two about math and science. As a Bangor High School senior, he finally qualifies to participate in the Regeneron Science Talent Search, the country's most prestigious science and math competition. This year, all held virtually. My research was on developing a real-time fall detection system for the elderly. And the motivation for this was that I heard many instances of older adults falling and not getting help for hours or days. Vetri found through CDC stats that each year 25% of older adults fall. 20% of cases the individual remains falling for over an hour before getting help. Vetri dove into developing a solution, creating this wall-mounted system that detects when a person falls and needs assistance. This system would be especially effective in nursing homes where it um, they, they tend to be short-staffed and you can't always be checking on the person. Vetri's project was submitted along with almost 1,800 other entries. Now he has made it to the top 40. The top 40, um, they give you $25,000. Um, which is really helpful for college. His mentors say Vetri is creating a gadget that can solve an enormous challenge. You got a kid who did this work at home. You don't have to go to a high-tech laboratory and have sophisticated equipment. You can do it in your house. He just has so many ideas and is always kind of always thinking, always creating. For this design, Vetri used a low-resolution thermal camera and a small computer called a Raspberry Pi. After a ton of research, reading, and trial and error, it can send an automated phone call or text message, and text message would be good because then it can also attach the imaging question um, so that you can look at it yourself and see if you, need, you want to go drive over and check on them. But what is perhaps most impressive is not his age, rather his motivation to make a change in the world. I think Vetri is going to be a, a kid who's really going to contribute at a high level to society in a positive way. In Bangor, Hannah Yashivi, New Central Maine. Wow, the 40 finalists will participate in a final virtual competition in March. The winner gets $250,000 to pay for college expenses. Vetri wants to study applied physics and computer engineering to be a professional researcher or maybe start his own business.